Now, the South African president, Cyril Ramaphosa, applauded the launch of that new climate fund. He also noted that a lot more capital is needed in order to address the damage inflicted by climate change. The Kenyan head of state, William Ruto, also highlighted the importance of turning Africa, with all its latent potential, into a green powerhouse. As South Africa, we applaud the landmark decision of COP28 to operationalize the new fund on loss and damage. And we also welcome the pledges that have already been made. If this fund is to effectively support those countries most vulnerable and that are affected by climate change, we need to mobilize more funding in a much greater scale. Turning Africa into a green powerhouse is not just essential for the continent. It is also vital for global industrialization, decarbonization. Going forward, clear, actionable roadmaps for implementations are required. In turn, this call for a unified global effort to mobilize the necessary capital for both development and climate action.